Hello, you're watching GB Times. I'm Clément Bono from Paris office, and there is today's top news. Yesterday, more than 10,000 angry farmers protest in Paris, and they wanted to show Parisians what is their real life and their hard work. They're angry at Stéphane Le Foll, the agricultural minister, because he's not listening to them, he's not listening to their complaint. They're protesting against the international uh, policy regarding the prices of cereals, because cereals is the main a factor for them because this is what they feed their animals, their cows, their sheep. And if the cereals are too expensive, they are forced in the end to sell their productions at loss. So they are not, make, they are not making enough money to live. So that's why they came to Paris, to the capital city of the country, uh, to show to the country what their real life is about. And moving on, also news important, making the headline in front. It's more revelations uh, about the financing, uh, the campaign of Nicolas Sarkozy, the presidential campaign of 2007. Uh, Thursday night on French television, uh, the former translator of Gaddafi told a uh, French, French journalist that Gaddafi himself told him that he had given more than $20 million uh, to the campaign of Nicolas Sarkozy. And on Friday, former chief, chief of staff, of one of Gaddafi's son, uh, explained the financing system of the campaign. He said that first the money went to Lebanon through a bank in, in Beirut in Lebanon, then went uh, to Germany through a, a businessman who is now under investigation in France, then the money went to Panama and Switzerland, and in the end it was for the financing of uh, the campaign of Nicolas Sarkozy, which is uh, uh, a really important accusation because in the end if all of these is true all of the campaign and the mandate of uh, Nicolas Sarkozy was based on a lie, on a lie to the nation. So this affair about uh, the money from uh, Gaddafi and Libya and also the money that uh, Nicolas Sarkozy would have taken from uh, the billionaire Lilian Betancourt uh, is a risk for uh, the polit politis uh, politics in France and the UMP uh, party, the right party at uh, the moment, so the next few months will be quite difficult for uh, Nicolas Sarkozy to prove that is innocent of all these allegations. Thank you for watching GV Times. You can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter. I'm Clément Bonneau from Paris Office. Thank you.